Hey party people, welcome back. So I'm in Maryland at the Westfield Mall about to go Lego shopping and I'm also here with my friend Kinsey. Hello. <laughs> She's a super Hi. casual Lego fan. I actually got her into Lego. You got me my first Lego set. Yeah. The DeLorean just came out recently and I'm still, you know, on vacation. My bags are still small, but I'm thinking if they have it, I'll try to buy it and bring it home because I don't know if our Austin Lego store has one. So yeah, I don't want to risk it and like not be able to get it when I get home. If I can find it here, yeah. I want it. So yeah, we're gonna go Lego shopping today. So let's go check it out. Woo. I'm gonna leave my beanie here, but check it out. Isn't that cute? I wore my pink one at Legoland. I also have a teal one. I'm just gonna hide it so it doesn't get stolen. There we go. Woo. So I've only been to Baltimore a few times and I don't think I've ever been to Annapolis, Maryland. Have you been here before? Not to this mall. So we're gonna check out the Lego <laughs> store together. I'm excited. This mall is kind of huge. So we're like navigating. Kinsey has it in Google Maps. It's like ridiculous. <laughs> Okay, so we just ran into a box lunch here. We want to check it out. Have you ever been in here before? I don't think so. No? Okay, let's go. Oh, Tigger. Oh my gosh, and then there's a whole Snow White wall. Aw, I love that. And then over here, they have a giant Aloha tie-dye Stitch shirt. Ross hates tie-dye, but he likes Stitch a lot. So I feel like that would cancel out, so he would enjoy it just a medium amount. I've been on vacation now for like five days. Oh no, I broke it. Oh no. And I really miss Ladybird, but these totally look like Ladybird. I miss my dog. Tons of Baby Yoda everywhere. So what do you think? Wow, so much good stuff. <laughs> <laughs> okay, so we just left Box Lunch and the Lego store is actually really close. So we're gonna go check that out. Are you excited? Yay. I'm so Yay. excited. <laughs> do you need anything or are you just, you're just here? Maybe, I don't have to travel back with the suitcase. <laughs> that's true. I might have to ship something. I'm kind of nervous about it. Oh my gosh, okay, that's funny. Tony Shark right here. It's so cute. Ah, we have a shark like this in our Lego store, but like they didn't name it. Oh, the DeLorean. So this is the new set. So there's three different versions you can do. Here's like the first one, second one, third one, obviously. And there's different accessories you can add to it to make it look more like the different ones from the movies. There's the hoverboard. I have that from Lego Dimensions. And then the minifigures. Gosh, these look so cool. Yeah, I definitely need to get it. I hope I can fit it back. It's a lot of pieces, so we'll see. The box will be destroyed. And then some other stuff they have here is the giant Titanic here which is awesome. This thing is just massive. Like, I don't know what I would do if this just showed up at my house. Like, I'd be overwhelmed. I don't know if I would even enjoy building it because it's just so big. We've got the globe in there, the at, -AT Disney castle. I haven't seen that on display in a while, so that's kind of cool. We have a second one we want to build into the costume shop. Let me know if you want to see a live stream of that soon. And then the stadium. Woo! Those printed pieces inside are actually really cool though. Wait, and then this Batman art. I haven't seen this one before. I think that's like a different version or is that like one of the combinations you can do? I don't know, but that's really cool. And then there's some other art on the wall. Ooh, the big Elvis over there too. The glare sucks, but that's Elvis back there. And then up top, we have some Easter fun there, which is really cute. And then the vintage taxi. I didn't know that was still around. The little gift with purchase. Oh, that's so cute. Free gift, get Easter chicks with purchase over 65. Awesome. Well, maybe we'll qualify today. So this store is a little bit smaller than I'm used to, but check this out we have a bunch of the creator expert stuff down here the stadiums and then this one here i pointed this out recently but i just realized that it's i love heart lake city on the box like i had no idea that that was on there i didn't know there was like a friends reference so that's cool i'll have to go find that piece i don't know if that minifigure is still holding it but i'll have to go home and check the boutique hotel elvis and then oh the mickey mouse is 10 percent off i have two it's like on my background but Good to know, 10% off is pretty decent. And same with Harry Potter. Santa's Visit is pretty well in stock. They have like five or six here, or maybe more like four. I still haven't finished building it when it came out in December, so that's kind of embarrassing, but maybe I'll finish it this December. And then here's the gift with purchase taxi. This is a really cute build. Like I really like it. And then that guy kind of looks like the donut thief from the police station. Like they kind of look similar. Same kind of thing going on. This is the coolest packaging ever. Oh, you like the, like, the shoe box? Yes. Isn't that cool? That's so cool. Some people get two and then build them mirrored so you have left foot and right foot. Discovering Lego. Discovering I'm Lego. such a bad influence. <laughs> Sorry. <laughs> and then we have the Lego Ideas Space Station. We don't have this one. We don't really have any space sets, but they look really cool. And the same with this one. This one looks awesome, but I don't know where I would put it. And then some more space sets. This one looks really cool. I've just heard that there's issues with like the red coloring where the red is slightly different in the bricks. So it like looks kind of wonky when it's done. And then the globe, Disney castle. Wait, what's this say? 
hard to find. Oh no, get it while you can. And then I have Ghostbusters, the guitar, and then some more creator expert stuff, but then check this out, the Spice Girls are on display. These are really cute. I posted a video recently on Instagram kind of showing these off, and I loved building them. I think the Brickheads are just really creative. I love the printing on her, like the little leopard print, and then the flag printed pieces. They're so good. I got these for you once, Kinsey. Oh, yeah, they're sitting on my dining room table most Aww. of the time. <laughs> they don't die. It's great. They don't die, and I kill plants so easily. Oh gosh, and then Mindstorms. Let me know in the comments if you guys have this set. We actually just ordered it. I am so excited to start playing with this, so stay tuned for some robotic stuff coming soon. And then we got these for our wedding. We like made them look like Ross and I. I think they were our cake toppers. It was pretty cute. Oh man, I feel kind of dumb now. I bought this one at Legoland New York thinking it was exclusive, but like they have it here. That kind of sucks. <laughs> oh well. And then Big Bird. I haven't seen these ones before. These are adorable. All right, so here's the Disney princess stuff. I love this set, but I just think it's a little pricey. Like 40 bucks is kind of a lot, but you do get a horse and the butthole tiger. So like, that's awesome. There's also like this piece here to flying carpet. So it is pretty cool, but 40 bucks just seems excessive to me. Oh, they have Encanto. This was so hard to find for the longest time. Just like the movie was so hyped up. You couldn't find this for like months. Okay, check these out. So these are Dot's message boards. So like imagine like in college having that and like making your own patterns or whatever on it. They're really cute. Like me and Ross, those are the ones that we use for that video where we like, made each other different art sets, essentially. That's so cute. I made him dog mom and he made me a mystery machine. I've totally used that in like my dorm room. Yeah, right? Yeah, yeah I really like that Dots is like stepping it up, like with the bigger pieces and the plates and like these pieces along the side, they really help. And then speed champions. I've talked about these a lot lately, but I really want to get into them. That one has caught my eye for sure. And then there was a yellow one. Oh yeah, the Supra. That one looks really cool too. So stay tuned. Maybe some speed champions at some point. Tony Shark again. That's funny. They have a sense of humor here. I love it. And then like, I guess these are all the Lego store employee names with their sig figs. That is so That's fun. good. That's really cool. <laughs> and then here's some Lego City space stuff. We saw this one at Legoland and we saw this in person finally, like those blue archways for the dome. They're really cool pieces. I hope to see them more in the future. Oh, Kinsey, check this one out. So this is the squirrel battle pack because it comes with two different squirrels and that's like a big deal. <laughs> Yeah. <laughs> They're like new molds for the squirrels and in two different colors. So like people are really excited. What do you think of the friend sets? Do any of them catch your eye? Like, would you like them or are you like not into them as much? I feel like they're so bright and happy. They are. That is true. This one's actually really awesome. Like it, it works perfect for like Lego cities and like that one, the colors are incredible. Like I actually really enjoyed building that one. This one was probably one of my favorites from the wave this year. It looks so good. And then like the food trucks, there's a taco truck. Like that's awesome. That's so cool. It's so good. There's even like ramen bowls on the picnic table there. It's no. so nice. And then this one, the Heart Lake City Grand Hotel. We saw two of them at Costco recently and so we wanted to get them because they were like 30% off, but we didn't and now we're so disappointed. Ooh, so this one's new. New, the Infinity Saga minifig pack. We just got this one at Legoland, so that's awesome. Tons of the Marvel stuff here, the new mechs. That's exciting to see. But yeah, there's nothing really that I need right now in the superhero world. Ooh, Kinsey, do you know what's going on with that set? Doesn't it have a butt? <laughs> it does have a butt. It's the butthole tiger. <laughs> so yeah, like there's a pink stud behind it and it's, it's the butt and like the internet lost its mind. I still think it's hilarious. It should. <laughs> So yeah, that's fantastic. All right, so we're checking out the picket brick wall and Kinsey is just fascinated by carrots. It's a whole jar of carrots. She like, loves what them. What do you do with them? <laughs> I think we got a full cup once of like just carrot pieces and we regret it. It was like a waste of $16. Well, yeah, it's just carrots. All right, so checking out the pieces on the pav wall. We have a few black ones up there, some snot pieces, tons of these trans red, which is neat, but if there were like bricks or plates or something with the trans red, I would totally get it. I don't know what I would do with those. And then down here, just tons of different plates. We also have these slopes. So that's pretty neat to see, like for a roof maybe, or for like a snowy landscape. And then some of these yellow pieces, we got these recently, I believe. I don't know what Ross wanted to do with them actually. I kind of forget. And then there's some angled ones. We got some of these too, just like to fill in the backs of like our Lego city buildings or friends buildings so that they look better in the Lego city. Some more plates, bigger plates, big plates. And these here would actually be really nice. I could use these along the sides of buildings to like create decorations or signs. I might grab like a little handful of those. Oh, and then up here, check these out. There's some more blue snots. Those would come in handy as well. But yeah, there's some purple plates. I might get those for like some friends mocks. That would be kind of neat. 
Let's see, what else? There's some more of these slopes here, the gray plates. And then this yellow piece. I just like, I love this, it's a brand new color. I don't know what I would do with it besides like a hospital ambulance or something like that. So I think we'll pass, but good to know that they exist here. Some olive green of these like, I see them used often for like pillows, you know, like the head of the bed in sets. Ooh, and then these are kind of nice for like a gate or something, like just some extra archway kind of details. That's kind of cool. I've never seen buckets at a Lego store. That's kind of neat too. Yeah, just like a bunch of just, you know, normal pieces you would normally see. Some of these, I don't know how to use those, so I'm not gonna get them. Those would be kind of nice for some more friends mocks, just like to build up a building. Like one by fours are just so handy. And then there's also purple ones. So like this color combo would be kind of cool. But then check these out. I have never seen this color on the wall, or at least I don't think I have. This purple, I could totally use this for Scooby mocks. Like the Haunted Mansion is this exact same purple color. So I think I'm gonna grab some of these, like for a roof maybe, like some details or like a little shed. I don't know, but it's really cool. Ooh, oh my gosh, and check these out. I've been waiting for these to show up somewhere. These are like the little gold bars, but you can use them for walkways. So like for the Disney area, I might use these for like sidewalks throughout. That would be really cool. Or even like along the beach maybe for texture. So I'm getting some of those for sure. Oh my gosh. I didn't see these before. I'm like shaking a little bit. White tiles. Oh my God. Look at that. Oh my gosh. I'm gonna get a full cup of these alone. Wow. Kinsey, they have white tiles. Oh, whoa. Do you know what that means? No. We can use them. They're good pieces. Whoa. <laughs> and then up here, there's some coral one by one plates. That'd be kind of neat for like a little mermaid area, just like adding texture there. But then these pieces, I think I, oh wow, someone already, okay, cool. Well, I might get some of these for like a stripe in a building when I'm walking. That'd be kind of nice for an accent in the building. Ooh, and then just a bunch of these one by, what is it, 12 bricks? That's cool. I don't think I've seen bricks this big before. So that's really nice to know. Oh my gosh, it fits. Oh, you built a car. Built a car. You're so talented. Wow. All right, so we're gonna get a few cups today. So we just got done with the pabbers, which is really exciting. We got two cups, I'll show you later. But then check these out. I'm still like obsessed with this mech. It looks so good. Like the whole new wave of Ninjago is just really overwhelming. And then hard to find Ninjago City Gardens. I'm so glad we got this when we did. It was so much fun to build. And like, we still need to work on a Ninjago area in the city. But then a nice little surprise here. I saw the Madrigal house. And I was like overwhelmed because it looks so good. And it's from Mel Brown from Lego Masters season one or Iceberg Bricks. Isn't this so good? Man, like all the flowers and details, like the pink frogs. This is incredible. I love this. So yeah, shout out to Iceberg Bricks. This is amazing. And then here we are in Harry Potter world over here. This trunk looks so much better on the box than in person. Like I'm a little bit underwhelmed by it. It's cool how it opens up, like it's really creative, but like it just looks so much cooler closed, I think, like for display purposes. Are you looking at the dinosaurs? I'm looking at the little dinosaurs, so cute. Aw, it's just the baby. It's the baby. Just the baby. He's feeding a carrot. A carrot. Aww. And then in Minecraft, do you know anything about Minecraft? Uh, nope. <laughs> <laughs> no, me neither. I like the little sleeping fox though, that's cute. And then they have a really good selection of UCS sets in stock, the Imperial Shuttle, the Falcon, at, -AT and then all the helmets as well, the whole collection. It looks really nice how they displayed all of it. And like the black boxes, I used to be very like anti to black box marketing, but it's really growing on me. It really makes the set stand out. Okay, so I just scanned this Technic truck in front of here and I think it might be doing something, but I'm not sure. Nope, I don't know. Okay, wait, it's actually doing stuff now. The truck's going. I've never seen that. Okay, wait. That's cool. Wait, come back. Oh, there it is. Wait, you want to do it too? Okay, grab one. Just stand there and hold it, I think. <gasps> oh! Wait, this is so That's cool. Okay. Aw. Your flowers. <laughs> I never knew how to use this. Okay, we need to poo. Okay, What's it going to do? Oh my gosh, they're running around. That's so cool. This is so cute. Oh, that's neat. The glare is terrible, but it's so cool. Oh, whoa. Oh, they're running through the door. Apparently there were some extra bricks in the back, so I'm gonna get another cup now and fill up some more. Whoa, check them out. Eek. I'm totally gonna use these for Mario World. You're doing great, Kimzy. You're learning. You're doing amazing. Alrighty, so here's cup one. We just filled up another cup with all of these green pieces. And cup three. Ooh. So I think that's it now. We have a bunch of our pab pieces. I think it's time to go check out. We have three cups. So maybe we'll qualify for the gift of purchase. I think we're close. Ooh. 
Maybe. <laughs> Alrighty, we just checked out. All right, so real quick, let me show you everything we got in this bag. We'll do a little mini Lego haul outside the Lego store. So first up is this cup here. We got a bunch of these one by four white tiles and then probably like 20 or 30 of these purple pieces. I thought that'd be really cool for the mystery mansion. And then on the bottom, I got maybe 20 to 40 of these black pieces that hang over the edge. I thought that'd be cool to add some dots pieces onto to create banners. Next up is the surprise cup. So they came out like at the end, we were about to check out, but they told us that they had a bunch, like a whole new box of one by four bricks. So we grabbed a whole cup full essentially, and then filled in some gas with some more of these one by two little gold brick things. Those will be really good for pathways. And then third is this cup here. This one kind of looks like candy. I just love the colors in it. But check out these new pieces. These are, well, I guess they're not new pieces, but it's a new color. I grabbed them just to like add some accent to buildings maybe. And then again, a ton of these tan pieces. Some of these teal one by two plates, some one by four purple plates, and then some more tan ones to finish it off. And I unfortunately didn't qualify for the big gift with purchase, but I got this little Easter one. I think I'm gonna give it to Kinsey so she can build it. Oh my god. Do you want it? Yeah. Yay! There you go. <laughs> <laughs> Enjoy. Alrighty, so we just left the mall. We're heading to the garage now, and then I think we're just gonna be what, like exploring Annapolis a little bit? Yeah, going on a boat. <laughs> we're going on a boat, wait, really? Yeah. I didn't know that. Going on a boat. Gotta ah. see the chest peak. Oh wow. <laughs> Alrighty. Yeah, I'm really excited that we found so many awesome pieces on the pad wall today and I also got to show Kinsey the Lego store. Yeah. So that was really fun. <laughs> what did you think? Were you like overwhelmed or was it cool? There's so much to look at, but there it was is. cool. Yeah. That's true. Yeah, it was cool you teaching me about all the pieces. You like, like the pieces? I do. Yeah. So yeah, we have a pretty busy day ahead of us in Annapolis, including a boat apparently. So I'm excited. Yay! So yeah, anyways, y'all, thank you so much for watching. Please do subscribe if you're new and we'll see you next time. Bye! Bye. Ha <laughs> ha